Hi, my name is Leslie Reynolds. I'm a sales director with Mary Kay, and I just want to say thank you for taking some time to watch this video today. I'm not sure why you're watching. Maybe you have some interest in Mary Kay and, and you'd like to get some of your questions answered. Maybe you are helping out a friend or family member who maybe is um, doing this as part of their training, or maybe they have promised you something for watching. But whatever the reason, thank you for taking some time to watch today. Now, I'm going to be pretty brief, so uh, I probably will not answer all your questions. So I would love to have a follow-up conversation with you and just kind of get your feedback on what you hear today. So I'm not sure who you are, okay? If I was sitting across the table from you, I would ask some questions. I'd get to know you a little bit better and get to know more about your life. But because of this format, I can't do that. So um, I'm not sure who you are. Maybe you are a young woman. Maybe you're fresh out of high school or college, or maybe you're a new mom, or um, you're a single mother maybe. Maybe you're married with no children or married with older children. Maybe you're a woman who works in corporate America or um, a woman that's retired. Maybe you um, are an empty nester for the first time. Uh, whatever it is, I want you to know that none of that matters. Um, in Mary Kay. It doesn't matter what your educational background is or your ethnicity or where you live or what your personality is. Anyone can be successful in Mary Kay, I believe, when they have two qualities. And that's when you are willing to work and willing to learn. And when you have those two things, anyone, I believe, can be successful in this company. So I want to just share with you a little bit about my journey in Mary Kay and um, how I got started. So uh, I started my business um, when my daughter was in fifth grade and I was actually homeschooling her and my son was a toddler. He was about two when I got started. And so when I started my business, I actually was looking for something to do to make some extra money. You know, we were a one income household, which can be tough. And um, my husband makes good money, but it was all gone at the end of the month. So I really was looking for a way to supplement some of that so that we could have some fun money or you know just to not be so tight at the end of the month and so um, when I was looking into starting a business I was actually looking for two things how much could I make and what was it gonna cost me to get started and so it cost hundred dollars to start my Mary Kay business back then and it still cost hundred dollars to get started and we make 50% commission that's one of the highest commissions of any direct sales company in America so I thought I could do that. Um, you know, if I'm gonna take my time away from my family, I wanted it to be worth it um, because family's really important to me. And so I got my business started and what I found really quickly was that I was able to work very part-time and make good extra money for my family. Um, I really only worked a few hours a week. Um, I would work on the weekends when my husband could watch the kiddos and I was still able to do all those things during the week that were important to me. I was able to do the homeschool groups and the sports things and um, and teach my daughter during the day um, and just work very part-time and I made some good extra money. And you know, I am a super shy person. I'm pretty kind of introverted by, by nature. Um, that's just who I am. And so um, I really was kind of worried. A big concern for me was how am I gonna meet new people? I'm not super outgoing. So that was a concern for me, but what I found was that um, I was taught how to meet new people from the people that I did already know. And so I was able to take those people I knew and I was taught how to meet new women from them and how to network. And so my organization over time um, grew. And so that was definitely a plus for me being taught that. And so um, what happened for me, um, I worked part-time for a long time and then my daughter was getting ready to go back to school she was actually going into middle school and I really wanted to be able to put her in private education um, but there was just no way that we could afford that with what we had coming in at that time and so I made the decision to move up into leadership in the company and so I became a sales director at that time in Mary Kay and I was able um, from that income to be able to afford to put both of my children in private education. And so, so grateful for that, um, for having that choice um, that my Mary Kay business gave us. And so I know that there are a lot of reasons that women come into Mary Kay. There are a lot of reasons that women start and stay in Mary Kay. Um, some women do Mary Kay part-time for forever. Some women come in just to kind of get their products at a discount to get their 50% off their own personal products. And some women come in and, and they truly make this a full-time income for them. And so I wanna just kind of share with you the top three reasons that I have that I stay in Mary Kay. The three things that I love the most and my business has um, 
um, done a, a ton. There's a lot of reasons that I love my business, but I think the three stick out the most. And the first one are the friendships. You know, being um, an introverted person, I, I have never really had a lot of girlfriends, but oh my gosh, through my Mary Kay business, I have met amazing women. And the women that I have met through Mary Kay are truly faith-filled, supportive, just amazing women that I get to be around. And, um, you know, we truly support and encourage one another. We want everyone to succeed. And I just love that. I'm very grateful for those friendships. And another thing that I love is the confidence. The confidence that this business has given me. I didn't have a great um, self-esteem when I started my business. And so through my Mary Kay business, I have learned how to speak in front of people and I've learned how to meet new women and I've learned how to run a successful business and how to teach other women to run successful businesses and all those things have just helped to build my confidence and I'm so grateful for that and the third thing that I love the most about my Mary Kay are the choices that it has afforded me and my family you know money's not everything but it gives you choices that you wouldn't have otherwise and so um, the choices that my Mary Kay business has given me are um, just countless. I mean, uh, we, we have earned four free cars in my Mary Kay business that we are able um, to drive. We um, are able to, to still afford to put both of our kids in private education. My daughter actually is um, a freshman in college this year, debt-free. Um, she'll graduate college debt-free because of my Mary Kay. And my husband and I are able to travel every um, year. We go on a leadership con conference and he comes with me and we make it a little mini vacation. And um, you know, just being able to still operate like a stay-at-home mom while I'm making an income. I'm able to be flexible with my schedule. I'm, I'm my own boss. I get to decide when I um, take off and when I go on vacation and, and um, I'm able to decide when I work and I'm able to still take my kids to school and pick them up and go to parties and um, you know go to um, the school parties and eat lunch with my son and all those things that are super important to me I'm able to still do because I have chosen to work my Mary Kay business. And so that is just a little bit about me and my journey and I just want to thank you again for listening and I would love to have a conversation with you so I'd love it if you would just reach out to your um, consultant that asked you to watch this video and just let her know you've watched it and then let's um, set up a time to just talk really briefly and just get your feedback and, and just see what you thought so thanks again